So just how did our kids spend their summer vacations? Some worked, others took out of town trips, but many of our kids took advantage of lazy summer days to learn. Take these Ballard High School students. They chose to earn extra class credit by taking art classes this summer. Right now I'm making a dress out of paper napkins and plastic spoons, forks and knives. I'm making a dress out of extension cords and CDs. We're using Photoshop. You get to take a picture of one of your artwork and you get to load it to Photoshop and like make it a headline page for a magazine. These kids are giving up part of their summer and getting up um, at a you know, pretty much a regular time to come in and uh, start um, um, taking classes at 8 o'clock in the morning during the summer. Uh, so they, they have an obvious interest in the arts, I think, to start with. And it's much better to put some spots in for your lips. You do not have to finish your lips. You can go mm, and stop and go someplace else. The idea is that when we paint during the year, we improve a lot. And over the summer, if you don't stay active in what you do, you regress and you lose what, what new skill you compiled over the year. So I'm here to make sure I stay sharp. The reason why Ballard promotes their summer art program, which is a volunteer program, the students pay tuition to come during the summer, is because um, it helps um, foster, uh, uh, foster the creativity and the arts of students coming in. We might have students coming in from the eighth grade that want to get a jump on the game and start to hone their skills. Our eighth graders that are coming in, uh, it's really advantageous to them because they get a full year's credit, number one, so they've already accomplished that. Um, you know, they've already got to jump on the game in terms of graduation credits needed um, for high school. But at the same time, it allows them to bypass that introductory art course. Art is important to me because I like the ability of being able to convey exactly what I feel on all my pieces, like the ones up there, and it's just therapeutic for me, I guess. It's nice. Some of my favorite pieces will be uh, these two over here. It's an idea for my theme this coming year, and I wanted to do something involving conversation and emotion with people, and so using those bubbles, thought bubbles, you kind of put out there the emotions of the conversation that's going on, and so I really like the way those come out to the audience. I really like fashion, and I really like like making things, and I've always drawn stuff, but I've never actually like made them, so it's different. I really like doing it. I'm sewing the napkins together in this design, and then I've hot glued these um, spoons and forks and knives together onto the dress at the top. It's creative, fun, get, just to let yourself go. 